The zoology collections at the Illinois State Museum include a taxidermy collection, which is used in public programs and exhibits, both long-term and temporary. We have different types of research collections, including mammals, birds, entomology, freshwater mussels, and a very big comparative skeletal collection. One of the major important parts of our collection is the comparative osteology collection. That is the collection of skeletons of vertebrate animals, so birds and mammals, fishes, reptiles, amphibians. Different types of specimens are preserved in different manners. So we have a lot of taxidermy mounts. We also have dried skins that are used for studying and research. We have skeletal material that is also stored dried. Amphibians and reptiles and fishes are usually stored in fluids and alcohol as a preservative. In the mammals alone, we have over 12,000 specimens that have been cataloged. Out of that 12,000, over 10%, over 1,200 specimens are one single species, the white-tailed deer. Collections that we have at the State Museum are important because this is how we learn about Illinois and about the world around us through these research collections. Um, they're telling us about animal populations today, but also over time we're able to compare modern animals to historical sites and even to extinct species that no longer are found in Illinois. So they're a really important part of research, but they're also part of training the next generation of researchers. We have many school groups that come through and uh, in students who are doing research projects that come and use our collections, and so this is forming an important part of their education and training for the future.